So let's get as far as we can, and then we got to make our way back. Cause, oh my God, this is gonna hurt, guys. Oh God. <laughs> What's up? What's up, Game Wars? Chief Rocky here with another episode of Atlas, and I'm stuck. I just logged into the game, so this happens all the time. Is he on me? He is. Okay, cool. Why am I standing sideways? Okay, anyways. So, I got me a little hot. We could actually turn this off, I think. Is all the meat cooked? It, It is not. It is not. Okay. So, we'll leave that going for a second while I show you around this area. So, this is the little hut. I had to hide for a little bit because there was a lion around here or a tiger. Lions and tigers and bears. Oh, my. Okay, but he was, <laughs> he was going around, and I was like, nope, I'm out. Um, and apparently, restarting the game uh, resets where the animals are, so that kind of saved my butt. <laughs> but this is made out of all wood. It is no longer a thatch hut. Um, we got doors. This took a lot of, of um, a lot of, a lot of resource collecting. A lot. Now I I learned something new, um, in the comments from you guys, and I I appreciate it very very much. So I learned that if I use a pickaxe on trees, I get more thatch. If I use an axe, I get more wood. So thank you for that. Appreciate that very much. You guys rock. Thank you very much. With that being said, now you see three doors here, right? Okay, there's a reason why. This one right here, I'm going to isolate this little area right here and it's going to be where I keep my chickens. Very unlikely that anything could get around or down here to kill them. So I thought it would be a perfect place to put the chickens. Uh, right now I'm going to just leave them on the boat because that's probably the safest place for them. Until I finish off this, I want to put a little gate there for right now. Uh, I'm going to continue on the on the hut this way and make it literally a house. So it's going to go here and then out this way and then up. So this door would basically cut off and isolate this room, which I'm not sure what I'm going to make it at this point. But it's here, right? Obviously the storm shutters are there. Boom, done. Easy, right? And it accesses the beach right there. That's where the minnow is. It's perfect. Now, I did do some exploring of this place, but not too much, right? Um, I think I might know where the pirates are, but I want to risk it. <laughs> um, apparently, there's two of them, I think. So, I, uh, actually, four. So, I got to be careful of them. Um, and I, I need to find water desperately. So, I think in this episode today, I, I did build these. Uh, but you see there's no water in this one. And there is some water in this one. So we're good. Um, at least on water. What do I have in my inventory? I think let's switch this one out with this one. And when it rains, it will collect water. And we should be good to go. Okay. That was weird. But we'll go with that. Okay. Is it done? I don't want to lose. Yes, it is. So we could turn this off. Wait. And put out fire. Okay, we're hot, so let's go get some moisture on our body. And I think the first place we're going to start at is... There we go. Let's come over here to this cove where we saw the alligator. Because <laughs> you know what? Anything with danger. Why not? Let's do that first. <laughs> so obviously there's a big elephant right there. I know that's going to take a while to tame. I did watch some of Survival Bob's videos. Um, and the, especially the one where he did with the elephant and I already know it's going to take a minute. So, all right. What do we got up here? Looks like we possibly can climb that thing. Let's see what's up there. I should probably go a little slower, right? Is that a chicken? That is a chicken. That's a male. I need females. <laughs> we got a male chicken. Okay, let's get up there. Let's see what's up there. Thank God that al the alligator's not here. Crocodile, whatever it is. We'll find out later, I guess. Whoa, 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 whoa. Another rattlesnake. Nice. And I got a level up. I guess let's, uh, let's collect his hide. So yeah, rattlesnakes are a thing here. Um, and you find them pretty much everywhere. <laughs> Pretty much everywhere. I do need to tame a pig. I think I need a bolo for that. We can build a bolo. So, 
probably be easier to ride a pig. Keep me a little safer. All right. What's down there? Chickens. This is a pretty big island. I'm actually impressed with it. This would be a good place to build like a lookout or something, you know what I mean? I come up here and see what's going on. But is it really worth my time in single player to do that? I don't know. What do you guys think? Leave a comment. Should I build an outpost up here and have a lookout or is it really not worth my time? This is pretty nice. There's a lot of wood up here though. Uh, another snake. It seems pretty snake infected infested though, so maybe it's not worth my time. Is are snakes worth taming? Do they do anything for you or are they just like like a pain in the butt? Okay, I don't want to go too far because I'm gonna fall into the water over there. I don't know how deep it is, so I could die. And probably get eaten by sharks. So don't want to do that. But this is nice up here. Cool. It's a good thing we could climb it. So we could access the abundant amount of wood up here. That's awesome. There's probably some coconuts. All the coconuts laying all over the floor. I'm not gonna go looking though. Let's get out of here. Alright, let's let's do a level up real quick. Let's see. Let's see what we got here. Um I'm going to go. Hmm. Let's put in some in intelligence. There we go. Um, tools. Let's see. Ooh, this gives us more stuff to build. Wood cliff platforms. Let's go up a little bit. Let's see if I could see the full list. Ooh, yeah, there, there we go. Uh, large storage box. Okay, I think we already have that. Lever, wooden signs, wooden billiards, uh, wooden wall signs, training dummy. Wooden canvas, large wooden wall, bookshelves, custom flag. Ooh, custom flag. Ship, ship cargo rack. That's pretty cool. Uh, wide medium wood gate. Wide medium wood gateway. And an ice box. Okay. Whoa. Oh. Am I? Do I already have that? I already have that. That's why. <laughs> Metal Urgily. There we go. Let's do that one. This one improves it. We'll do that one. Let's go over to cooking. I think we got a lot of the cooking stuff, but we'll go ahead and unlock some of this. We haven't done any of this stuff yet. We got a lot of that, though. Let's go over to sailing. Navigation tools. Ooh. I think I'm out of points. I have 71 points available. Do I already have that? I already have that. Navigation tools. Let's do that. Let's do this. Shipwright. Okay. Small handling sails. This is what we want because we're going to we're gonna definitely build a ship here soon. Improve uh, sightseeing. Yes. Medium sails. Merchant sails. Boom. Boom. All right. Um, what else do we got here? Beast mastery. Okay. We got to unlock combat. Because we're going to have to fight these pirates soon, too. So, let's do it. Unlock the armory. Nice. Unlock piracy. On the high seas, only one rule truly prevails. Bring the extra pants. <laughs> Bringing extra pants. Okay. The second and slightly more to the point rule is that piracy pays. It can pay in the way of gold, treasure. Spice and jewels, or it can pay in the form of lives, land, and glory to those who are willing to follow those two rules. Piracy becomes a way of life, and the tricks of the trade are taught in hushed voices in seedy taverns around the world. You know what? Let's do it. Even though I don't think this applies to this, but why not? Ranged weapons, of course. Um, Unlocks seamanship one point I don't have enough for it okay anyways let's go finish exploring I don't know how much time I have left in the day it is 1700 so let's get as far as we can and then we got to make our way back because oh my god this is gonna hurt guys oh god <laughs> oh 
Oh god. Wow. First death, guys. First death. Let's go respawn on the minnow. No, I want to respawn on the minnow. Respawn at minnow. There we go. All right, let me go get my stuff, and then I guess we're going to wait until nightfall. You poop on my deck. <laughs> let's check his inventory, make sure he's got... Okay, he's got enough food. We're good. He's good. All right, let's go get... Uh, let's go get Amber and uh, my stuff. Um, damn, that sucked. Damn you, Mountain of Death. That's what I'm going to call it. Mountain of Death. Well, we'll call that Hill of Death because it's really not a mountain. <laughs> Anyways, let me get my stuff. Be right back. All right, we're back. I got all my stuff back. And an alligator popped up right in the same area I said it might. <laughs> oh, God. Don't want to do that. Okay. So let's 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 do this compartmentally wise. So we've already got most of this lower area here by uh, the hill of death. Um, and let's make our way forward a little bit to, I believe, the north. Northeast. Let's do that. And uh, see how much I could get before it turns dark. Um, I definitely don't want to run into this alligator over there. I don't know if you can see him. But I managed to dodge past him. So we'll uh, we'll take the long way home. <laughs> yeah, right where the tiger usually spawns. <laughs> okay, so here's a cliff. I love it. Lover's Cliff. All right, some berries. That's good. Another little hill. Some more trees there. Parrots. I probably need to get me a cat. Like when you... They go and catch you some stuff. Oh, it's just a rock over there kind of texturizing in. All right. Not bad. I like this. Lever's Cliff. <laughs> I don't know why I'm saying that. Uh, I've been to Guam several times, right? And there's what's called Two Lever's Cliff. Like, I guess where like, they jumped off and uh, died. So it's just in my brain. Sorry. That's, that's the name of that place now. Forever. <laughs> I don't know. Can we climb this? Some flowers. We should be getting close to a pirate base. I don't know how close, but close enough. Let's see. Where are we at? All right. Here's that cliff area right here. Nothing new and special there. I don't know. Are there like special caves or something like along these cliffs? Let's go look. Is that fresh water right there? What is that? Is that a patch of fresh water or seawater? Oh, that's seawater. Okay. Whatever's. I thought that was kind of funny looking. I was like, eh, maybe... Okay, yeah, we wanted to go over here. It's getting dark. We're going to have to cut this soon. Let's see what's over here, and we're going to head back. But I want to see if there's like any secret pirate caves. You know what? Let's just go through the water. Ooh, there's grass under the water. Nice touch. Not the limes. Don't expire. Not the limes. What am I going to put in my gin? Ooh, that sounded gross. Never mind. Definitely not limes. <laughs> All right. I just want to see what's here. And then I think we're going to head back to our little hut. And call it for the night. Come back and finish. Ooh, look at this. This looks pretty cool. Pretty deep right here, too. Oh, my ADHD kicked in. Yes, yeah, so we're going to go back to the hut. Let the night play through. And then finish discovering the rest of this island. Gibtoas Ref uh, Refuge, I believe it's called. 
All right. This is pretty cool. Nope, oh, there's no secret tunnel. Oh, darn. Woe is me. That's a nice little beach, though, right there. How deep is the water? Let's see. It's actually pretty deep. Right out to there. This is good for like a, a little a little tiny uh base. Wouldn't be bad. With a tiny seaport. You get the cliffs here. Is that another snake? I can't see it. I think I heard it though. Is that a bull? That's so cool. Okay, so it's turning dark. We got this area all uncovered. Yep, rattlesnake right there. Two of them. There's one. There's two. At least I got meat for days. All right, guys. All right, guys. Um, we're back. Um, it looks like we're getting attacked. I don't know by what. Oh, a snake. You see my monkey throwing poop? <laughs> He throws poop. Okay, I think I fixed my axe too. Oh man. That was it's a good thing I have this hut. I could have died. I could have died. Alright. Gimme that meat. Yeah, 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 yeah. Meat. Okay, we not um yeah, I'm not gonna bother cooking it, but I will drop off this here. Nice! Nice. Okay, so we left off, and we got, like, I want to say the southeastern region. Um, so we're going to head back to there, actually right in the center of the southeast region, on the other side, just north of that little beach we found. We're going to go explore that. So let's head off and over there, and I'll be right back as soon as we get there. All right, so we're at the beach that we left off at before it turned dark. So let's go ahead and head up here. I don't think we're going to be able to climb that mountain. At least not from this area. So we'll skip around it. It would be kind of cool to go up there and check it out. But um, it's not really a priority at this time. How much stamina we got? We got plenty of stamina. We could run. I got plenty of food too. In fact, we might need to stop here shortly and uh, replenish. Can we make it up there? I think we sure can. You know what? It might actually benefit us to make it up here. It looks like a high peak. And we might be able to look at the rest of this and kind of... If I could view it, I might not need to survey it by foot. That makes sense. In my head. <laughs> okay. Um, is that me moving? Yeah, that's me moving. This looks non-traversable. Let's see here. Hmm. Nope. I'm still going up. All right. If I slide back down to my death, I'm going to be highly perturbed. Oh, that sun though. Nice. We're at the top. Psych. <laughs> All right. We're getting close though. Oh my God. This is a big mountain. This is perfect. Don't, 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 don't do it. Oh, nice. Ooh, we almost slid off there, guys. I think this is as high as we could get. Is this the highest peak on the mount on the island? No, but pretty damn near close. Let's get over there. Very nice. I think we could skip a lot of this just by looking over the land. Perfect. Okay, so there's a valley there. Just nothing but trees. That's a mountain. So that's got to be that mountain right there on the map in the middle. Okay. We know there's a valley down there. Ain't nothing much in there. So we could skip that. Over there, there's got to be some pretty decent resources. There's a nice looking beach over there as well. Let's look down this way. Yep, just looks like a beach. Don't slide off. 
There we go. Wow. Up in the mountains, man. I feel like a, a mountaintop jungle of like one of the islands in World War II. Maybe like a Iwo Jima or something like that. The vegetation's pretty thick here. I can't really get a good visual of anything down below. I gotta be very careful not to slide off. Okay. I know there's binos. We gotta research. Looks like some type of bird creature down there. It's a decent looking beach. Okay. I think we've seen enough from up here. So I'm going to descend safely. <laughs> oh my goodness. Let's see what we got here. I should be looking for resources too. Woe is me. I should be looking for like metal and stuff. So maybe going through those areas on foot and taking a look at some of those rock formations and seeing if they're metal would probably be beneficial than just writing it off saying, eh, I seen it from the air. Let's do that. Let's do that. What is that? Is that an animal of some sorts right there? Or is it just a bush moving? What's that? A sheep. Look at that. The grass is so high, I can't really see it. That's pretty cool. Oh, he's like in the ground too. Well, I know I could come up in the mountains and get some sheep. That's perfect. That is really perfect, actually. That's really cool. It's really hot. No, really? I'm in a tropical island. That's the beach that we discovered the last time. Let's see if we can go over this way a little bit. Up, up, and down. Whoa. Oh, it's just a cow. <laughs> I've learned to be very weary of seeing things move right now. Especially on this island. And the last island, man. The killing isles were... Oof. Oh, 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 oh. There it is. And I'm not that badly hurt. Okay. Just a little ding. So this is the valley we saw from the mountain. I don't think there's anything. Just nitrate and limestone. Some cows. So there's cows in this valley. That's good. Looks like a chicken right there too. Nope, that's just a seagull. Some sheep. <coughs> All right. Not bad. Some more rock formation. I don't see any metal. It, it The metal would be noticeably different. So far, I don't see any. Should see some, though. Hopefully. Hopefully. If not, I'm going to make trips to that killing arm. Whoa, God. What is that? It's coming after me, I think. Oh. I think scared the crap out of me. I don't know what it is. Let's go up and around. Wow, I actually jumped. What is that thing? Like, part of me wants to find out, and part of me doesn't. It's some type of bird. It doesn't look like it's vicious towards me. Well, let's get closer and see. Is that an ostrich? Yeah, it's an ostrich. Okay. Oof. Boy, that ostrich scare scared the crap out of me. <laughs> All right, another female cow. Okay, so I could de definitely domesticate some cows. This little valley right here is pretty good, pretty useful. I'm trying to figure out where the where the like the stone would be that has 
iron in it. I'm not trying to beat stone all day. Nice, a bull. A male scorpion. Um, that definitely looks dangerous. Oh, man. Please don't let me run out of spears here. <laughs> all right. Let's see what you got. Oh, nice. Organic paste, too. Look at that green goo. That's really cool. All right. Well, scorpions exist here. So let's be careful of them. There's another bull. Let's see. A level 31. I got to come back and get me one of those. All right. Nitrate. Honey. I bet that scorpion killed this thing. What is this? An ostrich. Well, let's take it. We're here anyways. Uh oh. Not like a snake. Feathers. Nice. Plenty of meat. What's that sound? It's got to be the elephant. It sounded like a tiger for a second or, or a lion. There's another ostrich. Oh, this ostrich looks like he got beaten up too. Aw, poor buddy. Another bull. I'm seeing things getting beat up. I got to be very, very careful right now. What level are you, piggy pig? Three? Nah, you're no good. We definitely need to get ourselves a pig. Those things, uh, you don't need bolos to capture them, but um, they're very useful. Very useful. Pick up scrubber, uh, shrubbery, can hold some stuff. Um, they, they do get overburdened pretty quickly. The pigs do, but um, they can hold some stuff for you. This is a giraffe. There's a beach down there. I don't think there's any iron down here. May as well check. It's not going to hurt to check, right? Turtles. I think this is all the same stuff, right? Yep. Oh, it's midday. And a heat wave. So let's go hit that water real quick. Good thing I made it down here. Didn't realize we were in a heat wave. All right. No carnivorous, vicious animals at the... Oh! <laughs> wow, those pirate ships, man. Just sitting, just chilling. All right. Nice and cooled off. Wow, they sit close to this island. One of these days, bro. One of these days. All right, where are we at with food? You know what? I think it's time to drink, and I think it's time to, to eat food. All right, let's drink. Perfect. All right, where are we at on food? Uh, let's get it on this rock. There we go. Now I can see what I'm looking at. Okay, Um. let's hit it with the 8. Let's hit it with the 9. Let's hit it with the 0. We're definitely going to need to get more berries. Definitely need more berries. Um, and with the fish. Let's hit it with the fish. Alright, let's move. Let's see what happens with that. A giraffe. I'm not too sure. Oh, dude almost stepped on me. <laughs> Actually, you know what? Since we're here. Berries. Probably taking the food source from the locals. I need it too. Deal with it. All right. Well, so far, no stone or no iron. That's a bummer. I might have to make it back to the killing aisles. All right, where were we at first? Okay, let's go around this mountain ridge. Um, and you know what? let's go over it. There might be iron on the mountain. Or on the hill. Whatever you want to call it. And it's going to save us time. Because we need to get to water. There's a heat wave. I think these are more berries, right? What kind of berry is this? Straw. Mm. I beg to differ, game. I'm injured. How am I injured? What's going on here? Hello? What 
Someone tell me how I'm injured. Did I take a break? Okay, that's what we're going to do. Okay, let's wait this out for a second. Bro, I think I'm going to die. And I died. That sucked. I have no idea what happened. Let me know, guys. Because <laughs> I have no idea. Alright, I guess we're, uh, we're respawning at the minnow. Oh, Lord. Alright, let me make my way to my body. I'll be back. Alright, Gaming Wars. So, <sighs> I died again heading back over this way. <laughs> And I figured out it was the heat. Um, it confused me because the injury side I got was of a broken bone. So I'm like, what injured me? So apparently it was the heat. So instead of marching. Oh, hey, look at that. What did I just do? I hope to God I didn't call my chicken over here. If I did, whatever. <laughs> I don't care. Um, but I need to figure out those controls. Um, but yeah, I think I'm going to rest here tonight. Um, and then, uh, lead off on the way forward. What I want to do is let's zoom in a little bit. I know it's hard, hard to see cause it's getting dark. Um, I want to head down the coast and just check out this coastline, see what we got here. So yeah, I'm going to break it here until it hits daylight. All right, guys. All right, gaming warriors. So it's early in the morning. We're still alive. We're still here. Uh, one of the things that Kumo especially showed me, right, he left a comment on one of my videos and he also put some stuff in Discord for me as well. So thank you, Kumo, on that uh, was markers, map markers. Now, I missed it. It's up here in in the uh, left-hand corner, right, upper left-hand corner. But if you press N and you could add a marker to where you want to go, um, I know there's a certain way that you could... Uh, do it without doing the longitude and latitude. Oh, here we go. So this is where I'm at, right? So I could put this as where I was. But there's a way to, like, draw a marker there. Hmm. I'm not sure how to do that. Hold 8 to use built-in camera functionality. Okay. Well, let's cancel out of this. That didn't do it. Let's try this one. Oh, there we go. That's what he meant. Thanks, Kumo. All right, so now we could do here. Saved view. Can I click anywhere here? I don't think so. These are quest logs. Okay. Toggle sediment markers, settlement markers, map markers. Save current view. No. What's this? Toggle following character, toggle beds. Oh, it puts their name on it. I like it. Toggle grid mode. I like grid mode on. Can we zoom out? Yeah, grid mode's on. Okay, cool. Uh, oh, there's the pirate camp. This only says there's one. It's a zero of four defeated. Is there four here? That's news to me. Okay, so how do I put... Where's this pirate camp at, though? It's right there. Ooh, boy. I want to verify that. <laughs> so this whole area is good to go. We need to go up this coastline. This coastline looks very promising. And the reason why I say that is where I'm at, you could see where it's really light blue. Okay. Oh, God, that was a parrot. <laughs> this, is, this means that it's shallow. This whole area over here is deep water. That's great. This whole beach is deep water. So I don't know if this is going to be my permanent area or not. I don't know. Right now it's it's there. I like the building I have, so I might just stay. Um, but this is very promising as well. Um, let's see if we could do... Nope, nope, nope. Toggle ships. Okay. Info of island. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay. Um, I got to figure out how to do this stuff. But N apparently saves. Um, can we do this? What's this flickling green thing that I'm seeing? And it, it turns red when I'm... 
What's that mean? If you know, put it in the comments below. That's it's really intriguing to me. It's like some magic fairy dust, <laughs> like something off of Peter Pan. Okay, now ah, uh, let's see. Can we hold N? No, we can't. Here's my longitude and latitude. Now I wouldn't be able to put it here. So I could put as was here. Okay, so we have to put the longitude and latitude. Okay. Which is where I'm at right now. So if I write it down, I could put it that way. There's got to be another way. Give me a second, guys. I'll be right back. All right, Gaming Warriors. So after trying to figure out, like, how to use this map, <laughs> I've come to the conclusion the only way to set this map um, waypoints is the other way that I was doing it. So one... I had to reset the map keys, right? So I believe holding eight, now I can do that, right? Um, and I bring this up here, but again, I don't think, I I, I don't know. What, what I'm looking for is, I saw Survivor Bob do this, where he basically moved an arrow, right? Um, and then dropped a marker there. Now, I don't know if that's exclusive to Xbox, I don't know. Um, but that, that's what I'm looking for. Um, and it doesn't seem to see that I can do that. I can't click here. Uh, yeah, I can't click here and do any of that. So very confused on that. I was hoping that, you know, it, I could like put a map marker on there and then head towards it. But it looks like you could only put a map marker on known longitude and latitudes. I think that's how it is. So let me know in the comments below if that's correct. If I'm wrong, if I'm doing something wrong, let me know. I'm trying to figure it out. <laughs> yeah, it's just really kind of crazy. So I think what I'm going to do now is go down the beach line a little bit. And I'm looking for metal nodes. I'm I'm not finding any metal, right? And um, I'm kind of getting disappointed. <laughs> Man, I, I really need to find metal. That, that's like the most important thing for me right now is metal. I don't want to have to keep going back to the killing aisles. It's just going to suck to keep having to make trips back and forth. I don't mind doing it. It's time consuming, right? And I already have very inflexible hours. I mean literally inflexible hours. I, I stay up quite late sometimes doing recordings um, and that really really messes with my work hours uh, which then makes me like take long periods of breaks between the game which is one of the reasons why I what is this a dead parrot uh oh I think I know why oh that's an alpha I don't know if I could kill it I'm all in I'm all out of spears. Oh god. Give me the spear. Where's my spears? Uh, okay, I'm all out of spears. Can I kill it with the axe? Ooh, I just killed me an alpha. <laughs> oh my goodness. That was kind of scary for a moment. Oh, this thing's giving me tons of stuff, bro. So if you don't know, alphas are like supremely stronger. And um, yeah, I'm very surprised I was able to kill that thing. I did lose one of my, uh, oh wow. I did lose one of my spears though, so that's kind of frustrating. Can we repair? Yes, we can. Okay, let's put it into health. There we go. All right. Um. Oh, yeah. We need to put this back on our hot bar. Okay. Like I was saying. Yeah. So it kind of. That's one of the reasons why I take um, like two weeks to upload my first videos, um, and I kind of have everything kind of drawn back a bit. Um. So by the time you see the video, it's it's normally two weeks. This video out, however, I'm recording it literally the night before. It's like one o'clock in the morning, and I got to be up at work at five. Um. So yeah, I'm I'm really feeling the pain right now, uh, but that's mostly because again the the time crunch is just so 
so bad, dude. So I try to find ways of um, minimizing long durations of things, right? Uh, so if I have to travel great distances for something, well, that just makes it kind of annoying. I'll do it. Doesn't mean I like it. Um, and it just takes me longer to get things done. But I'm, I'm really praying that we find some metal nodes on this island. Another level up. Wow. Let's put it in health too. Dude, I got a lot of level ups. I still got more? Dude, that alpha just crushed it for me, dude. Okay, so 111. So I unlocked medicine. So there we go. Let's go ahead and do improved underwater breathing. Let's, oh, God. What is that? Another rattlesnake. How am I missing this thing? Oh, my goodness. These rattlesnakes are just all over the place, dude. Yeah, so I'm just praying that there's metal here. That's just going to make life so much easier. All right. Um, you know what? We'll go and do some of that other stuff. I figured uh, um, the traits, obviously, afterwards. Uh, let's see where we're at. Let's reorientate ourselves. Okay. You know what? Uh, let's go to this little mountainous or not mountainous. This, this one section of rocky, like, just jutting up on the map. I don't know if you can see it. It's just like a little small piece. I'm going to head there and then head north. And see if I can't go along the rocky cliff area. And see if I could find me some uh, some metal. Uh-oh. You know, I was really looking forward to this area of the beach, too. Um, to see how it is. Because if you did notice, you see, um, if I back out a little bit. You see where I'm parked at, right? Where the minnow's parked at? Let me put the map here where the sun glare isn't that bad. Do you see that light blue? That's a lot of light blue, right? That means that it's really shallow. But you notice on the beach I'm here, right here on where the X is, that's where I'm at, it's a lot deeper. So I don't know if moving up here would be more beneficial, but I'm finding a lot more dangerous creatures over here, man. I don't know. Look at this. Look at this. What's going on here? It's a male chicken. It's been hurt. It's almost dead. I'm thinking I'm thinking it's a rattlesnake. There's a turtle. I'll leave it alone. I'm not taking away that guy's dinner. <laughs> I'd probably eat him too. But I do have to be a little bit more cautious now knowing that uh there are things over here damaging things. So All right. This is the outcropping I was talking about. I don't see anything. Now, what I'm expecting to find is metal nodes, like, really not attached to, but just hovering along the side of the mountain area. That's the last uh, area I found it in um, the Killing Isles, was it was tucked up right against the cliffside, right? So that's kind of what I'm hoping for. And it looks like um, I'm just fresh out of luck. All right, where am I at now? All right, let's head up north. Actually, you know what? Let's keep heading over here, and I'm going to check out the side of this mountain. See if we got any better luck here. So far for the uh, terrain, I don't see anything differing. Um, animal life is still pretty much the same. So no, no new vegetation or anything I could pick. I'm still looking. Oh, let's get what let's get wet. Yeah, see this is a lot more deeper. Quicker. I like it. But I think we're gonna stay where we're at. Alright. Let's see, what's this? Nope. Oh wait, it said iron. Did it say iron? It did say iron. Let's see what it gives us. Let's see what the yield rate is. Basalt, limestone, basalt. Nope. Okay, so I am right. These little ones right here give us the possibility, I guess? The possibility of iron. Okay. 
But I was right. It's along these mountains because that, that's the first one I've seen that do that. Do that. That's okay. Still nothing. Okay. I'll keep an eye on those. It's not looking like I'm having too much luck. I'm not here to uh, harvest all the iron. I'm here to find them. All right. Did I come to the location I was looking for? Yes. Now, it remains kind of rocky around this area, so let me see. I might be actually on the rock cliff. Maybe I'm going to find some here? Maybe? So far, I find no nodes or boulders. That sucks. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Huh? Wow, this is pretty cool. I like that cliffside right there. Nice. This is a very gorgeous island, by the way. I really do like the setup of it. Mountainous, decent beaches. Pretty, pretty cool. Right, I'm not finding any nodes. I think this... Huh? Wait, what's this? Yeah. Ah, wait, hold on. Oh, that's that. <clears throat> Alright, getting too hot, so I better find my way back to a beach. And it doesn't look like I'm getting close to a beach that way. <laughs> if I did, I wouldn't be able to get back up. So... Okay, we should be on our way to a beach over here shortly. Okay, here's another mountainside. Maybe. Maybe we'll be lucky. You would think that like going underneath the vegetation like this um, would provide us some type of like, I don't know, shielding from the sun and prevent us from getting that hot. But, you know, what would I know? I'm not a game designer. I just live in the real world. <laughs> to their defense, it might be too difficult to do something like that. But, you know, I don't know. I'm only guessing at this point. A lot of elephants, so I'll probably save. Okay, there is no nodes or rocks along this mountainside. Uh, maybe we're too high in elevation? I don't know. I'm guessing at this point. Okay, I think that's the end of the mountainside, right? It's got to be. It kind of is. Okay, now we're just going up the mountain. Okay, that's the area we just came from. Hmm. Mm, just trees. This tr what? What's this tree give us? Softwood, bark, and resin. Oh, I bet the resin is like a... Uh, Sap or something, right? It's got to be. That'd be good for fishing, too. Ah, I think I... I remember watching a video where uh, a person used, like, some type of device to basically drain resin from it. That would be super cool. i got to figure that piece out. All right, nothing's going to get tagged. There's ostriches here. Oh, boy. I don't want to fall down that. We've already had that that problem. Can we go down this side? I think we can. I think we can. I think, oh God. Oh, that hurt. Not that bad though. Okay. Giraffes. I keep forgetting about the insects. I had one scorpion attack me so far, so just keep an eye out. All right, it's midday. All right, so we're low on the cliffside. Maybe there's something here now. Maybe. Crossing fingers. There's a cow. Maybe. Maybe. Let's go up here. Maybe. Maybe. I bet this is going to be one of those islands where I bet I, I have to uh, break rocks like a prison worker. <laughs> it is like... It's going to be so damn rare that it's going to be hard to find. That's what I'm thinking. I might have uh, better luck with, you know, every time I make a travel, just stopping at the Killing Isles. This is a crappy beach. <laughs> All right, this one's off limits. Secured. <laughs> All 
All right, where are we at? We're at this little one. All right, let's go around this little rocky thing right here. See if we can find anything useful. Any rock outcroppings? Any nodes? Can I make it up this? I sure can. Man. At least I think I'm right, right? Like you follow these and you're you're kind of liable to found iron. Okay, there's iron in this thing. There's iron in this thing. So these big boulders no there's no way. Iron. Iron. Okay. So these big boulders will probably yield you some. It looks like most everything here has iron in it except for like the stones around my area. <laughs> So maybe one day just bring the the boat over here, bring the minnow, and uh, load her up. I think that'd probably be a good thing to do. There's no way in hell I'm going to be walking around up loaded with uh, iron on me. Overloaded, that is. Oh, what's that? Bro, that's not a ship of the dam. What is that? Oh, oh, we need water. There was some in there. Okay, cool. Bro, that's an actual pirate ship. Look at that ship move. Dude, that thing's so cool. Oh, look at it shift its sails, too. Bro, that thing is so cool. Okay, so that means I'm going to need to kill that thing. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Oh, I think there's pirates here too. I think we're getting close to that waterfall I saw. There it is. There it is. This is where we get our fresh water from, boys. Well, this is a nice little beach here too. That pirate ship kind of is going to stop me from coming this way a lot, um, which is one of the reasons why I want to find out how to get here. But look at this, boys. Look at this. This is a picture moment. Let's get a picture. Oh, yeah, boys. Let's put this away. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, we want to do... what? Which, one's, which one releases? Uh, I think... No. There we go. But I can't take pictures that way. <laughs> okay. Um, I know there's a way to do this. Okay. Camera mode. That's right. Look at this, boys. That's just gorgeous. That is just gorgeous. Okay. So... I'm wondering. Let's go around this way. Uh, I'm hoping I don't run into any pirates. Well, at least we'll know where they're at, right? Um, maybe I should just go get a dip in the water real quick. Does this count as fresh water? Let's see. Nope, it does not. <laughs> okay, we took a dip. We're at 100%. Oh wow, 98 already. It's that hot. It it doesn't say that it's a heat wave, but we're losing we're losing wetness quick. All right, so these pirates look like they're right there. I could see their camp. Can they see me? Doesn't look like they could see me. So, uh, let's fix this map, dude, cuz it's all I don't know what's going on with it. Can we center the map? Can we can we do that? Oh, let's do this. Maybe it's not centered, that's why. I don't know what's going on. What's going on with my map? Oh boys. Tell me what's going on with my map. Can we no? 
Pago following character. There we go. <laughs> I knew I was doing something wrong. Okay, so here is the waterfall. We want to find the the entrance to it, right? Like where it starts. We still have to make our way around here and over here, and then we're done. But these guys are at the other edge of this river, right, of the falls. I think we're good. I don't think we're going to really have any problems with them if we stay on this side, right? So we should be fine. No problemos. Okay, so that's pirate number one. I know there's another pirate by us. And I know that there's one in the valley area in between where it says uh, Gyp uh, Gyptorus Refuge. There's one in between that crevices there. So, so I know of two, now three of them. So there is possibly four pirate bases on this island. And it looks like they're level five too. So I don't know how high of a level that really is. Uh, and I'm not trying to find out at this moment. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, I forgot to look for rocks that look like iron. But I haven't seen any yet so far. Nice, dude. Look at this. Look at this. This is just gorgeous. Oh, man. These waterfalls are just... Look at this. Oh, man. I can fill up here, right? Perfect. Let's not drown. Okay. Is there any like freshwater fish or any or something? This is great, man. I was running out of water, and it hasn't rained here yet, which means that my water buckets uh, or barrels haven't made any water at all. None. Uh oh no no no! I wanted to press six. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I haven't made any water. Let's see. Is there any freshwater? Fish. Oh, there is. What's this? A catfish? Oh, that's super cool. Catfish. Another catfish. What's this? This is all catfish, right? No, like freshwater bass or anything? What's this? Catfish. Is there piranhas in this game? That would be cool if there was. More catfish. Dude, there's plenty of catfish here. So it doesn't look like we're going to go hungry. If we really need some fish. Catfish. Catfish. Stone. <laughs> What's that? Crude oil. Bro. That's cool. That's different. Can we come up this way? Can we do it? I don't think we can. Nope, we can't. Okay, so we're going to have to come up over this way. I'm sinking. Maybe because it's fresh water. I like the way that the fresh water lo looks a little murky. It shouldn't look murky, though, because it's fresh water. But okay. It's not like a, a dirty river, but okay, we'll, we'll go with that. All right. That looks like, uh, is that a pirate camp over there? I don't think so. I think we're good. Okay. And I haven't seen any stones that indicate iron. Where are we at right now? Okay, so I think these blotches right next to me, I think that's indicating water, like fresh water at least. So at least I know that now. If I need water, I come up this way. I take a journey. I take a journey through the jungle, the jungle book style. <laughs> Still no iron nodes. Oh, wow. We came up past this waterfall. There's still more water here. That's got to be a lake. Let's see. I'm really excited about this. Really excited about this. What's this tree offer to? Softwood bark resin. Okay, same thing. I would think a different style tree would have something different. Uh-oh, we got another one we got to do. My bad. Let's do more health. Okay, we're going to do this in another time. Let's go ahead and uh, figure this piece out. Nice, it is a lake. Not only that, but there's a river going up there too. 
Bro, this is so cool. And it splits off that way too. If I fall in there, is there a way up? Yeah, right over there. Let's go. Oh God. <laughs> What's in here? What's that? Okay, same old stuff. A lot of catfish. I like I like the way that the bottom of the lake looks too. It's really cool. Wow. I'm gonna build a boat on this. <laughs> Put a raft on this. You know, that's actually not a bad idea. I want to go up this way too, though. I want to see where the uh, water source is. So this means that there's um, another waterfall, maybe. There is. Where does this waterfall go? I haven't seen this one yet. Or is this the same one? Is that one going out into the ocean too? Hmm. Let's see. I think this takes me over there by the pirate base. Okay. So there's two waterfalls on this island. Yep, there are two waterfalls. Yeah, this takes me up by the pirate base. Like how close to it though? Like close enough they start lobbing uh, cannonballs at me? Let's see. How close can I get? Can you see me? Can you see me? Save some of my stamina, I guess. What's over here? Oh, just the river. Okay, we're following the river. This is the same one we were looking at earlier. We were just on the other side. Okay. Well, I know the pirates are over there. I'm not going to mess with them. Whoa, what's that? Was it the elephant? Please tell me it was the elephant. Okay. Looks like it could go up there on the top of that. And I don't know what it's really going to give me. Other than just a better view of that. Ah, oh, these damn rattlesnakes are all over the place. I'm not going to waste meat though. Steaks for days. Speaking of which, better look at the hunger bar. Ah, we're going to be alright. Alrighty, um, that's lower. Let's go ahead and jump off this into the lake, actually. This is exciting, man. I'm having a lot of fun with this right now. Oh, here we go. Not even looking. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. Let's go up this way. I want to see where this uh, this river goes. I want to see where it goes. I want to see where it starts. Where's the lifeblood of this fresh water? Okay, I know I've seen lions here before. Not specifically up here, but on this island. And I want to make sure that I'm not going to get, like, assaulted out of nowhere again by another lion. I was lucky enough that I had fast reflexes. Oh wow, this this water is actually like flowing down. That is pretty cool. I want to see it up close. Looks like there's a pirate base up here too, so. Yeah, it is, guys. Look at this. It's so cool. Is this crude oil too? What is this? What is this? Must just be like uh, how they're using the stream, but this is cool. Can I, uh, no, I'm not going to drink the water just to find that. There's got to be like a lake or something up here. What is this? Female scorpion. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. I don't think I'm ready for this one. 
Do I still have my bow and arrow? Ow! Ow! That freaking hurt! Okay, he's... Uh-oh. What am I doing? Okay. He slowed him down. Bow and arrow. Gonna take a minute to load up. Okay. Any time today, Bo. Didn't do nothing. Now, now I'm doing da damage. Oh, nice. Ooh, boy. I got one arrow left. This guy, man. He made me waste everything. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, I got seven. Okay. Never mind. Let's take this meat. These things got horns on the top, man. That was pretty close, though. I thought it was going to kill me. Nice. Okay, that's the first time I've used that though. Successfully though. That's that that's the keyword. Successfully. Okay, so there is a freshwater reservoir up here. This is super cool. Uh oh. And I know they're gonna see me. Can we swim under the water? Oh, that's a crocodile. Oh god. No, 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 no. Okay, we're not going to... Nope. Get me out. Get me out. Get me out. Get me out. Whew. Okay. We're out. It's turning night. So, we are going to... Uh, Go ahead and stop here, and we'll be back as soon as it turns daylight. Hopefully nothing kills me up here. Oh, my God. It's a damn jungle. Like, we are in the thick of it, boys. In the thick of it. Oh, wow. Wow. You know what this reminds me of? Guam. All right, we'll be back when it turns daylight. All right, so it's nice and bright early in the morning. You can see the sun just rising above this mountain. To the east, I believe? That is to the east. <laughs> All right. Anyways, let's make our way up here. If the, It is cold here, by the way. It is 58, 66 degrees up here in this mountain. I had to build a fireplace last night just to stay warm. Uh, it is crazy cold up here. So, I don't want to stay up here too long. But I do want to see this gorgeous view from up here. It's got to be crazy, crazy good looking. There's another pirate base down there. Is there really? There is. That's all four of them then, right? Hmm. That is all four. Okay. I didn't know there was one in here. Can they shoot me from up here? I don't think they can. Okay, so now I know. I was over there when I discovered this area. That area is just gorgeous too. I don't want to go over here. But I did want to go over here though for one reason and one reason only. I wanted to see if there's like a cool pirate cave. <laughs> Alright, so what else do we have up here? So... Let's go this way. Obviously, I do not want to mess with that pirate base over here, but I do do want to see what's up here on this mountain. Okay, we're getting close to that pirate base. The good thing is I now know where to get fresh water from, which is awesome. I have everything I need to do or everything I need and know where to get it to survive. Right, we're coming up on that water source again. Obviously, I don't want to go in there, but I want to see how far along it goes. 
Oh, wow, there's an island in the middle of it, too. That's so cool. Okay, I, th I think we're on the other side. Of where it was shooting at us. That's the start of it. This is the start of it up here. This is this is the reservoir. Now if I fall down there, I'm trapped. There's no way up. Or there's no way out other than going through that pirate base. I'm not trying to have that happen. I gotta be careful not to fall in there. That's pretty cool. That is really cool. Oh man. Anyways. Yeah, let's get away from this thing. Um, and I think this takes us to the other side of the island. And it does. Nice. I don't think I've been to this side ever. Kind of curious to see what's over here. A lot of elephants. Lots of elephants. Oh, well, there's a lot of... A lot of elephants. I think I'm, like, overstating that now. The male bulls. Wow, this is crazy cool looking over here, too. Nice. There's a lot of tameable stuff on this side, man. I think I picked the wrong side to... <laughs> I think I picked the wrong side to hitch up at. <laughs> this is a cool looking beach over here, too. I'm, I really want to make some more spears. I think with the spears, they just do more damage when you throw them. These you got to be crazy accurate with. Uh, a lot of berries over here, too, so now I know where to get berries. Very nice. Very nice. This beach isn't half bad, either. I mean, I probably could have done, like, either one. You know what I mean? How how shallow is this? Eh. Uh, right here, it's not. But when we make our way over here, it's it's going to be pretty shallow, so. Here we go. Oh, nice. Very nice. That was a lot more powerful than I thought. Hmm. Maybe you should just stick with the bow and arrows. Damn, rattlesnakes are just all over the place, man. Infested. I'm surprised I'm not seeing... Oh, here we go. Now see, those two shots weren't very good. And I lost an arrow. Damn you, arrow. Uh-oh. The elephant's fighting something. Bet you it's an alligator. Oh, it is. Get over there and assist our little buddy. Who I don't even know. Oh, it looks like he killed him. Let's go check that out. I found a dead one earlier. It gave me prime meat. So that's pretty cool. Oh, yeah. It's a dead alligator. Is it dead? Gotta be dead. Crocodile. Dead. Level 1. Look at the size of this behemoth, bro. What, what are those? Okay. It's just its skin. <laughs> I thought it was some like, weird crazy markings. The scales look like frosted flakes. <laughs> Just chopping at them frosted flakes. Nice. Prime meat. 
Okay. So let's make our way back. Oh, this parrot. He's on the deck. Oh, no, he didn't like that. He didn't like that. Okay, let's go this way. I haven't been over here yet. Well, I haven't shown you guys the inside of the, uh, is it Gibto, Gibtoas? Gibtoas Refuge? Refuge? I gotta be careful coming along this side, though, because of the pirate base. I'm gonna have to make a run for it. Do I have plenty of stamina? You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna stop right here. Right at this little uh, narrow pass and just rest real quick because we're going to make a run for it. Can't shoot a move target. <laughs> I mean, you can. This is going to be really difficult. Can I go up this way? I don't know. There we go. Nice. I don't think anybody's ever been in this little crevasse, except for that seagull. <laughs> okay, let's rest here. We're going to make a run for it. To the other side of the beach. Okay, we're ready. Let's go. Oh, God, this is going to hurt a lot. Oh, they can see me. I can see them. Can we go up that way? I don't think so. Oh, they're shooting. Oh, they shot two. And the next. Ooh, Pirates of the Caribbean, bro. <laughs> oh, my God. I hope there's no crocodiles in here. Look at this, though, guys. That is just gorgeous. The only problem with this, right, is you only have this area here, which I would say is somewhat of a tidal area. But the problem is, is it's still pretty damn shallow, right? I mean, I wouldn't take any of the larger ships in here. It's just it's just too shallow. You might be able to get a schooner or um, a sloop in here. But past that, I mean, I don't know. I don't think so. We could try it. Definitely try it. Oh, God. Can I use this underwater? I don't think so. I'm about to find out here in a minute. Stay away from me, Stingray. Stay away. Stay away. Yeah, you know what? You we might be able to get the the sloop in here. This would be a pretty cool place to have a base, though. You know what I mean? Oh God. Okay. He didn't want to play. This place is super cool, though. I bet you'd be really hard to navigate through there. Yeah. Can you imagine like building a wall? I bet you someone's done it on a multiplayer server somewhere. They built this gate and you have to come through it. Be super cool. Man. But we we circumnavigated this entire island. We were up there, guys. Actually up there. And it's super cold up there. Where what's the temperature right now? 81. It was 65, 55 degrees up there. It's crazy. This island has a little bit of everything. With the exception of snow, of course. So yeah, that's that's this entire island, man. Um, this is our new home. I'm pretty excited about it. I think off camera, I'm going to make a trip back to the Freeport I started at, and I'm going to go collect the rest of the stuff at the shanty, bring it here, and I'm going to make some upgrades to the Ramshackle Sloop and start working towards building a shipyard and all the extra things I need to get that done so yeah i'm looking forward to it oh my god i'm really having fun really having fun with atlas i hope you guys enjoyed that's all i got chief rocky out